hello friends welcome to engineering tutorial so today we are going to resume our discussion on digital electronics and uh, so far uh, in the previous videos uh, we discussed about uh, Carnot maps k maps we discussed uh, about sop k maps and pos k maps so we used uh, no SOP expressions uh, mapping it into SOP type K maps and POS expressions mapping it into POS K map. So, in the next uh, few videos, what we are going to do is that we are going to plot POS expressions or max term expressions in SOP K map and SOP expressions, min terms expressions in POSK map. Okay, so it will be uh, useful for those who are used to drawing a particular type of K map. Suppose you are comfortable using SOP K map, then you can plot both min terms and max terms in SOP K map. And suppose you are comfortable using POSK map, the format of the POSK map, then you can plot both SOP and POS in POSK map. So we'll do that. So we'll be solving some questions directly and uh, with the help of that we will get used to how the things happen okay. So this is the first question. So here as you can see we have this boolean expression which is uh, given in terms of the min term values so this is an SOP expression and we have to simplify it using this POS K map okay so SOP expression using POS K map so here uh, we will be first uh, mapping this uh, k map according to this uh, min term values so the min term values are 2 3 6 and 7 so three variable expression so let us map 2 then 3 then 6 then 7 so as you can see we can form a quad here involving these adjacent cells now the next thing is the identification of common variables so as you can see in the horizontal side there is nothing common because here it is a here it is a complement and the vertical side we have b bar common so here it would be f is equal to b bar but this would be a POS expression because we are using a POS K map but we want it in SOP form because it is the min term values which are given. So simply we will take the complement which is simply B. This is the SOP form. So in the other questions where we implemented POS expressions using SOP K map we did the same thing but there we used to plot the zeros using SOP K map and then we used to get the expression in SOP we used to complement it we used to get it in POS so here just the opposite here the reverse thing is happening we are using SOP expressions using POS K map so please watch all the videos related to implementation of POS expressions using SOP K map. Okay, so this is the first question. So this is the second question uh, related to implementation of SOP expressions using POS K map. So here again we have this SOP expression, three variable expression, which is given in term so of the min term values. So we'll map it. So it is 0, 2, 4, 6. Okay. 0, 2, 4, 6. 
so again here a quad will be formed so these two adjacent cells and these two adjacent cells now we have to identify the common variables so as you can see in these four cells nothing is common in the horizontal side and the vertical side we have C common here C here C so it will be F is equal to C but this is the POS expression in order to get the SOP expression we have to just do the complement little C R this is the SOP form okay so here this is the simplification of this SOP expression using POS k -man. so this is the second question